Welcome to Cyan's World of Art, and today we are going to draw some yummy foods. A tempura. It's so, sort of like something you can find at a sushi place, and it's so yummy. All right, we're gonna begin by drawing slants like this. After that, we are going to go up, curve around, and back up. We're gonna draw the little tail here. It's just one, and then the other. The next thing we're gonna do is we're going to do the same for this one and loop it one tail two tail now just draw a little line here so it's like to show like there's like a little hole there and then we're going to draw like little little bumps here and just make sure you just put a little big bump there. And then I'm going, this is optional, but I'm gonna make it a little kawaii. You don't have to. But first I need to draw what looks like the deep fried stuff. So I'm gonna raise the slime just a little. Then I'm going to start doing bumps. But if you didn't erase it too well, there should be still a little marked line and you just follow it along with the bumps. Then do the same. Keep going. Until you get this bumpy looking thing. Yes, it's a thing. <laughs> now I'm going to erase this. And then I'm going to put bumps. Like that. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make it kawaii and do little faces. Now this is optional, you don't have to do this. But since I love doing this, I'm just going to draw an eye here and another eye here. Some eyebrows. A smile and little diamonds running across his teeth like this. And the last part, blush. I'm gonna color that in soon, but right now I have to focus on the other one. I personally think the other one's going to be twice the time as cute. So we do two bumps, then we do the mouth, which is kind of like this. And then we do blush, one, two, three lines, one, two, three lines, then a circle around it. And since mine is a little bit fat, then I'm going to trim it down.
like that. And now, since every piece of deep fried shrimp or fish, whatever it is, it always needs sushi. So we're going to do a little thin circle, like a cylinder. The next thing we're gonna do, we're going to fill out the stuff, you know, the stuff inside it. So it can be whatever shape or thing you want inside. I'm just gonna draw a little rice inside, which is just a scribbly line. And then, finally, we draw a face. And see, it looks so kawaii. Kawaii, kawaii, yummy, yummy, yummy. And then you could just color it. I'm going to make something. I'm going to see which orange brighter is that for this. this one. All right, I'm going to use this orange to outline this, this little bump. I'm going to do the rest with the other one. I'm gonna do one for now to speed up the video so it won't be so long. I might as well just do the sushi too because it's different. Different. So many colors. And I'm gonna do the tail. Then, I'm going to do the mouth. And um, I'm going to pick gray. <laughs> then I'm going to use my red and do the blush. One, two, three, circle and scribble on top. That's one, right? And you could just, with um, colored pencil, you can color it in, or you could just color it in with marker. So first I'm going to, of course, do this really quick so the green won't overlap it too much. Going to do the blush. One, two, three, circle. One, two, three, circle. Scribble, scribble. Then I'm going to trace it. This is the seaweed, my favorite part. I'm just going to put it on top. And I'm just doing, again, I'm just doing one of those fried fishes in the sushi, because then you can do the other one by yourself. Then we are going to color the end side of it. I'm just putting in random colors. So I can make this video quick. I don't know why I'm putting purple. <laughs> and there we are. This is our sushi. If you like sushi, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you want, you can comment below. Below, sorry, below. And you can tell me your favorite food and I might be able to draw it next. Stay tuned.